So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to search and type in registry editor. Click on it and then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you can follow everything I'm doing up here. So first you wanna expand HK local machine. Then you wanna expand system. Then you wanna expand current control set. Then you wanna expand control. Now you're gonna scroll down so you find session manager. You're gonna scroll down until you find session manager, click on this. And now this will appear on the right side. And then once you're on this, you wanna find boot execute, you wanna double click on it. And now you just wanna delete everything in this box, just delete this. Now you wanna copy and paste the command, which will be down below in the description. So we're just gonna highlight over this, control C on our keyboard to copy it, and then control V, which will then paste it. And then click on okay. And now for the second step, you wanna head over to search again and type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you want to type in chkdsk space full slash f space full slash r. And then click on enter. Wait for this to load. And then once this loads up, you want to type in y and then click on enter again. And now we're just going to restart your computer, but keep on watching the video. Restart your computer, keep on watching. And now as the computer is turning on again, it's going to be saying to skip this checking, press any key. Do not press any key. You do not want to press any key. You want to let all the seconds load in. It's now going to start running disk checking. You just want to wait for this to load. It will then take you back to Windows and then the problem should be fixed. 